It is recommended that every patient that comes into the facility be offered HIV and TB screening. So you can either do it by using this button that's written screening or you can click on the flashing red icon. The flashing red icon is there to remind the clinician to offer HIV and TB screening to every client that they attend to. So we're going to click on that red flashing button and it's going to take us to the patient screening overview. We do not have anything in the overview yet because we haven't screened our patient. So I'm going to go to the tab that's written HIV and then please update HIV screening. You click on update and then you have to ask the client if they've ever been tested before and if they've ever been exposed to ARVs and you put the rightful answers. I'm going to go ahead. Um, now it's showing that previous HIV testing, the client says they have not been exposed to ARV and they have not been tested before. I'm going to go on to TB. The client has not been screened yet, so I'm going to click on screen. And remember we captured their vitals. So because we captured the weight and the height, it's going to show us the body mass here. And then we're going to ask the client these questions and input the answers. Are they coughing? Is it productive or non-productive? I'll just put a yes here. No, no, no. And then click confirm. And then because the client is TB presumptive, we are going to need to record an investigation. But before we record investigation, I want us to go to sexual history. Please update client sexual history. So you need to ask the client if they are sexually active or not. Mine will say yes. Age at first sexual encounter with male. Age at first sexual encounter with female. So these are the questions that you ask the client. And according to the answers that they give you, you put those in this field. Number of sexual partners so far. Number of sexual partners in the last 12 months. Then click on save. Once you click on save, then we'll have other risk factors. So these are all the questions that you need to ask the client and you input the answers that they provide. So I'll put Martin Luther's answers and click save. So basically this is how you screen the patient. We're going to go back to the TV tab because remember because they were presumptive, we're going to have to record an investigation. But before we record the investigation, let's pause and move on to the next video.